a problem. And that is, I can never seem to reach my fitness goals. Let me explain. It feels like I've been working towards my dream summer body for the past 10 years. And even though I work hard in the gym, the devil works just a little bit harder. So this year, I told myself I was going to really commit to this goal. I had to figure out my strengths and weaknesses, and one of my biggest weaknesses is telling myself I'm gonna make it to the gym after work, and I literally never do. So I committed to waking up really early on the weekdays to make sure I made it to the gym before work. And when I eat, I'm prioritizing protein, whether that's a meal or a snack. And sometimes, I just gotta say no to the good stuff. So, in the past year of committing to this goal, I've learned a thing or two. And the first thing I learned is that you have to do what it takes. Let me tell you guys, I am no better than a freaking dog. I literally had to train myself to wake up at 5 a.m. in the morning by rewarding myself with energy drinks. And do I have an addiction to ghost energy now? Maybe, but you gotta do what it takes. Second, a lot of times, you have to say no to yourself and to all the temptations out there, but it's kind of worth it in the end. And the last thing is, you really have to ask yourself, how badly do you want it? Because if you really wanted it that bad, you would make it happen no matter what. And as I'm going through this literally right now, I'm realizing that these are kind of the pillars to commitment in general. And here I thought I was just talking about the gym, but if I really think about it, I think if you apply these things to any kind of sort of commitment, whether it's relationships or a goal, I think it'll work out. So.